and Baringo, particularly, and also some parts of West Pokot, has become an issue that the Turkana people now need it to be addressed. We've lost a greater population of the people of Turkana East. We've lost serious personnel, security personnel, who are committed to deliver in, in protecting the lives of our people. In the skirmishes of people from a neighbor county, I'm therefore appealing to His Excellency the President of the Republic of Kenya, whom I think he has all the mission to fulfill this once and for all. I am also appealing to the Deputy President because I had him recently, who is our chairperson for intergovernmental uh, council team, uh, can, uh, uh, I mean governance teams. He has just mentioned uh, yesterday that this job is his. Of course, I know you will deliver on that one because he was a security person. He was a DO and even a county, uh, even uh, uh, commissioner to that effect. I am requesting those two leaders to really come immediately to force and act on these uh, bandits. I think the people of Trugana County have been calm all through. Under my leadership, I think I will not stay back and watch these things happen. Because I was elected overwhelmingly by the people of Trugana County to come and see on which best way we can protect the people of Trugana County. Trugana County is engulfed by serious warring communities. From the northern part, we are engulfed by the over three countries. On this other southern part, a number of local communities from Kenya are really giving us a lot of headache. If you can remember the issue of Napeto, <coughs> where children were burned to death, innocent old mamas were burned to death, our wives, our women were burned to death, our men, strong men who had the ability to, uh, to actually run their families were burned to death. Up to this point in time, no action has been taken to bring justice to place. This is what really will anger even a person who has never been willing actually even to, uh, to become angry. We feel we should receive justice from the government of Kenya. We should re get justice from the security apparatus of this country because that is the role of a government. Immediately after independence, we said we will provide security to the people of Kenya and other good basic needs. So as a leadership of this country, we are appealing to government agencies to leave these other side shows, to give us security for the people of Trukana County. Trukana County is a county that is, has all the capacity actually to come out and defend itself. We are not going to participate in issues of stealing from a neighbor, but other communities. And some of the leaders, there are leaders in those regions who are inciting their own people to continue killing innocent Kenyans. A life of, of one Kenyan, just like the America takes a life of, of, one, of one American as a very serious thing. Ours also should be taken as serious as that. A life of Kenyans, innocent Kenyans dying, and no response to, from uh, uh, the security teams. And I want to blame the past government because that past government encouraged this. And I want to ask the current one not to emulate the failures of the past government that really gave the team from Baringo, those culprits from Baringo, to continue killing our people. So as the people from Capedo, from Napetom, Kamugi, those areas, we've witnessed a lot of death. We will no longer sit back and watch things happen like that. We will take one into the streets and cry the loudest if our voices will ever be heard by anybody so that justice is brought to book. That is exactly what I feel I should say 
uh, at this point in time. Thank you.